Good morning, CCHS students, staff, and visitors. Today is Friday, and you're watching Live on Camel Drive. I'm Destiny Irwin here with today's rundown and reminders. Today is Friday, February 24th, 2017, and it is a purple day. The weather outside is cloudy with a high of 27 and a low of 12. Lunch today is buffalo chili. For your weekend announcements, the CCHS International Club presents David Gonzalez at 6 p.m. in the library tonight and 7 p.m. at the Arbuckle Lodge tomorrow. Boys and Girls Basketball is in Sheridan, and buy a beanie to support the camels for $5 in the business office. State Swimming is at the Aquatic Center, and tomorrow, State Wrestling is in Casper. Have a great weekend. Hi, I'm Chase Cates, and I'm here with your late night sports show. Chase! It's almost lunch. Well, um... Hi, I'm Chase Cates and I'm here with your late morning, afternoonish sports show. On today's show we're going to be talking about... Godball. Godball is a high school recreational league for fun, basically. Um, so, let's go talk to some ballers. He's actually their coach. So, Coach Love, now, how do you feel about uh, your team right now? We're doing all right. You want to add on to that? We're about eight and two. Eight and two. Going in third. Not yeah. the greatest. If Shea would make a layup, that'd be nice. If Shea Rook would make a layup. Sure, I'm sure he'll get the message. Could I also uh, have one of my players out here? I'm not really comfortable about saying anything. I'll just. Can I just have a player? All right. Not a, it's not a very big desk, but, you know. It's all right. So, would you say this is your star player on the team? Absolutely. Absolutely. No doubt about it. He's actually out with an injury right now. Devin Delaney was put on our all-star list with Cole Percy. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Sorry to hear that. Yeah. Well, I should be back for the tournament. That's what's important. Yeah. yeah. How do you feel you're going to do in the tournament? Um, our first game is against Blitz Creek. We should be doing all right. We, we beat them during the season. I'm pretty confident that we'll be able to handle them again. All right. Well, I wish the best of luck to you guys. Thank you. Well, Austin, you can come on in. You can just find a chair. Or okay, that 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 works too. You're on the views, correct? Yes. Uh, how do you feel your team is doing right now? Not well. Um, you want to add on to that? No. Okay. Do you feel like you have a star performer on your team? Yeah. Who's, who would that be? Me. So, you know, they, they like to compare me to LeBron James. Well, the tournament's coming up. You guys got second seed, I heard. Yes. That's got to give you a little bit of confidence. It does. feels very good to be second in the tournament. Thank you for your time, Mr. Hester. So later on, we have the end of the regular season coming up, and we have some tournament play. So let's take it down to the court for some interviews. So I'm here with uh, B Squad right here. So how do you guys think your team's doing in the league right now? I uh, know I think we're doing pretty good. We're seven and four in the season, playing against an undefeated team tonight, and uh, we're just going to give you know our best shot. All right, um, you guys, you guys have a star performer on your team. Who's your, who's your best players? Oh, yeah. Or is it a team yeah. effort? Yeah. It's definitely a team effort. Team effort? Yeah. All right, well, I wish the best of luck to you guys. Yeah, you're going to Thank you. Yeah. I'm here with some players from the bench warmers. How are you guys' season going so far? Terrible. You know, it just really depends on how the outlook of, you know, how we just, we just got to keep just going in there every day. And it's just, we, we got the effort. 
Well, it looks like you guys do have the effort out there. It looks like you guys play really hard out there. You guys won a game this season. No, we've actually won two of them, but two of them. if you're looking at it from a spiritual level, I think we've won all of them. All right, thank you guys for your time. You're welcome. Thank you. In some first round tournament games, we had the Bee Squad defeating the Tropics. We had the Barking Kittens defeating the BBs. We had the Hall of Shamers taking care of Blitzkrieg. The Barking Kittens beat the Krusties in an upset. We had the Benchwarmers winning on a buzzer beater against Justice League. And in one of the most crazy games of the season, we had Cutlass tying the game with a half court shot in the fourth quarter. But in overtime, Chicken Noodle Hoop came out victorious. Let's go talk to some of the Chicken Noodle Hoop players after the game on the sidelines. All right, Timmy, Tyler, you guys just advanced to the next round of the tournament. What are you feeling right now? Oh, you know, just a bunch of emotions. Really glad we got through. Hopefully we can win the whole thing. Tyler, at the end of the game, you hit those clutch free throws. What, what are your emotions right now? What were you feeling at the line? You know, honestly, I didn't mean to. Very well. Good luck. Thank you. <laughs> So still in the league, we have two brackets. We have the A bracket and the B bracket. In the A bracket, we still have Chicken Noodle Hoop, Sons of Liberty, the Hall of Shamers, and the B Squad. And then over in the B bracket, we have the Views, the Barking Kittens, and the Bench Warmers. Good luck to all those teams. We'll see you in the championship. So in the B bracket, we had the Barking Kittens winning, and in the A bracket, we had the Hall of Shamers winning. So that concludes the sports show. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. That's all for today. For more information, go to cchscamels.com. Have, Have a great, great weekend. weekend.